Charlie is so cool like has been on YouTube since 2007, gaining 298 million views in total over the years. He is known for dipping in and out of YouTube, taking breaks, coming back with content and then going quiet again for a while. He's known for making short, funny, quirky videos about whatever's on his mind and they were refreshing. Anytime a YouTuber talks about why they started, they usually refer to Charlie and how he inspired them. The views on his channel started slowing down three years ago, a jump from averaging 500,000 views a few years ago to around 200,000 views, which isn't bad. He still had a core audience watching and then it came to a year ago and he was getting less than 100,000 views. And that could be because people had grown out of watching YouTube or they just stopped watching Charlie. From around two years ago, he started his fun science series. The last video he created was five months ago and then he stopped. And in March, on Twitter, he announced he was leaving YouTube in a thread. Hey, I should probably talk about the fact that I'm not making videos anymore. I've essentially quit the YouTube thing, which is weird because it's been a part of my life for so long, but it's also been a very healthy choice for me. It helped me to learn that my value as a creator and as a person can extend beyond being Charlie is so cool like. Turns out that tying up your perceived worth with your level of success on a website is a very bad idea. I found myself much happier creating things that don't need to have my face on them in order to exist. I'm also very fortunate that I currently have the opportunity to do just that. I'm still super proud of my creative output on YouTube, especially of some of the things that didn't, you know, go viral. Educating through fun science, pushing my creative limits with my short films, being vulnerable in I'm Scared. I find it helps to pick up your own metrics for success rather than blindly following the prescribed ones. For me, that was putting depth of connection over sheer amount of it. I always strive to make what I wanted to make, algorithms be damned. Also, emerging from a career on YouTube with my soul intact feels pretty darn good. Never say never, of course, YouTube is after all just a platform. Online video is just a medium. But if I ever do return to it, don't expect the same guy who made videos in his bedroom in 2007. So what is Charlie up to now? Well, he's doing screenwriting, more specifically a show called How They Made Her. The show will be a thriller about an AI character. It seems as though Charlie has found his passion project and this is where he wants his career to go. Well, that's going to be the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. The goal is 1000.